Just Lines Grand Entrance. Welcome back to There are Just Lines. There's a lot going on in the studio these past few days. We've got some jewelry, illustrated jewelry in the making. We've got the big drawing still being done. But today we're gonna take a little break and do illustration interpretations of famous iconic paintings. As a fun exercise, try taking a famous piece of artwork and putting your own fun spin on it. I'm not a classical painter, so I'm gonna put a cartoony illustration twist on mine. Among so many other favorites, I chose these four from which to choose, and I ended up selecting the Arnolfini because there's so much good stuff in there. Jan van Eyck's painting from the 1400s could not be weirder, but there were a few things that stood out for me right away that I want to address in my illustration. Number one, the fashions. You just can't beat them. The weird shoes at the bottom are so strange. Why are there oranges in the background when it's very clear this guy is not really high on nutrition? I want to address that mirror too. What's in that mirror? Can we get a closer look? This is going to be a lot of fun to do. All right, uh, I have kind of a square sheet here, at least what fits on film, which I'm going to have to elongate. But I think my first challenge here is trying to figure out how to get these people on the page properly. So I'm going to kind of just plot out where they're going to live here on the page so then I can build all these great things like the big hat and all the things around it. hard and fast rules to cartooning or converting a painting into a cartoon. So you should be able to do whatever you want, interpret it however you want, but I did a few specific things. 
The first thing I did was try to explain away the completely inexplicable. Number one, why are they holding hands but not looking very loving? What, what's the transaction going on? So he's holding a mint because she's got extraordinarily bad breath. And she's handing him like a pill of, or a bottle of, you know, men's testosterone type pills. In the mirror, I have the photographer that's taking the picture of them. Her weird headdress, I just decided it's covering her horns and that sort of thing. I also then, the second tactic I used was modernizing things. There were oranges in the background. I decided to put in a few modern touches like a hydro flask, Ikea furniture, Botox, uh, the silly and ubiquitous live, laugh, love sign on the wall. Uh, his tattoos, he's got a gauge in his ear, he's got some, you know, clothing logos, things like that. And then finally, I just went ahead and had fun with it. I just decided his fur coat should be alive because it's creepy and gross. Uh, the shoes, I just, <laughs> so strange to me. I made some big platform shoes with fish swimming inside, decided that the dog should be having some fun, there should be gum under his foot. And finally, that Pharrell should be calling looking for his hat. So have fun and do this yourself.